Okay, in this section, we're going to go ahead and cover 6.1 square root of a rational perfect square. So we do have a rule that says for any real numbers A and B, this is an equivalent statement. So whether you have um, the square root of the entire fraction or the square root of the numerators and the denominators individually, um, as long as A and B are real numbers, this um, equivalency holds. So 4 and 49 are real numbers. So we can apply that rule and say that this is equivalent to this. And then the square root of 4 is 2, the square root of 49 is 7, and therefore this square root simplifies to this fraction. Similarly, we could do the same here. However, before you do that, I would simplify your fraction as much as possible before you apply the um, square root rule or square root property. So for this problem, um, you can reduce the 18 and the 50 by 2. So when I do that, I get 9 over 25 and then I will apply that um, square root rule and so square root of 9 is 3 and the square root of 25 is 5 and that is the simplified answer for this problem.